Hey, what up you guys? It is your favorite Arkansas hillbilly here, Ruby Moonshine. And as you can tell by the bags under my eyes, it is six o'clock in the morning. My Miss Ruby, why are you up at six o'clock in the morning? You don't have work till 11. Why, because my feminine fellow, I had a video idea and I thought I had the time. Keep in mind, I thought I had the time before work. I mean, I have a good five, maybe six hours. Let's see if it's six o'clock right now. I don't have to leave till 11. Yeah, that's a good five hours. But anyhow, I saw this incredible video from Macha Muva Wa. Macha Muva Wa. That's not right. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm Southern and I have a list. Macha Nova Wa. I swear people with these usernames, what happened to the good old days when people had usernames like Kiki Cannibal and Lola Lobotomy? Yeah, good old days. Lola cyberbullying. But anyhow, I saw this wonderful video from them and I was like, hmm, I gotta try that out and I have five hours to do it. So let's go. Okay, so it turns out my bathroom, like, gets the best lighting. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it's painted with lighter colors. And, you know, the big spotlight over my head, maybe. I don't know. But anyhow, I ran to Walmart last night and grabbed a bunch of bath bombs. And I also had some pearl powder from my craft closet. That's not going to give me cancer at all. <laughs> it runs in my family anyway. So I got two of these and I got one of these and I also got some food coloring. Where's the food cup? Did I make it out to the car with the food coloring? Apparently, yes, I did because here it is. The food coloring. I mean, the food coloring. Gods, I hope this doesn't stain my bathtub, but I got finally got the water to this nice blue and using the bath bombs and the food coloring got darker, got to this nice darker blue, which I just love. And now I'm just going to add the pearl powder. Ooh, my hands are blue now. <laughs> got a little smurf on me. And the mica powder did nothing to it. This is fun. <laughs> now, do I think this trend is a fail from the get-go? Yes. Do I think it'll turn out looking good? Probably. I don't have much high hopes for it, but we're going to go through with it anyway because I got this far. Now, I don't feel like doing makeup makeup, so we're just going to uh, go on without concealer and just do eyeshadow and lipstick for this look, so yeah. Everyone just trust the process. I swear to you, just trust the process. I found this really frosty blue lipstick and I love it. Finally found my mascara. I'm now going to be doing some special effects makeup using this wig cap. How am I going to do that? Well, first I gotta put it on my face. Now I'm going to be using my highlighter palette and I'm just going to be contouring everywhere with it. Now for the final reveal and you cannot see it on camera. So I'm going in with this pearlescent blue from my uh, Northern Lights palette and we're going to see how that looks. Final reveal. Oh, come on. You can see it in the mirror, but you can't see it in the... You can't see... What the fudge sickle? I've done this before a million times, and it's worked out perfectly on camera. Oh, I don't have a layer of foundation on. Maybe that could be the problem. Because all the other times I've had a layer of foundation on, I'm going to try it like that. And at this point, I just said, screw it. I'm getting this transition done before work. Then I said, go big or go home. So yeah. And guess what? It worked. Ha ha. Now back to filming. Alrighty, so my computer crashed. Yay. So we're going to have to edit from my phone. Yay. Kill me now, please. All right, 
so we're going to edit using Pretty Up on my phone and I'm going to use it to enhance my makeup a little. So we're just going to go into makeup. A little bit of glitter never hurt. I'm going to ignore lipstick because I got the perfect shade of lipstick already on in this picture. For, well, for the video. Going to go in with these dramatic lashes and eyeliner. Let's go in with this one. I'm now going in with Vina. Vina is this app used to make aesthetically pleasing videos and edits. Right now, I'm just using it to do exactly that. I wanted the second half of the transition to look very mermaidy, siren esque, or whatever. Now I'm putting the first part of the transition and the second part of the transition together. I'm editing out the first part of the transition and the second part of the transition. Basically I wanted to make this little zoom in effect for the first part of the transition. So here's the final result and here's the original. Honestly, mine is no comparison. <laughs> but keep in mind I did edit it all from a phone because the computer crashed. Remember, if you can stomach my personality just a teensy bit and also you want to see more aesthetically pleasing videos and how I make aesthetically pleasing videos, photos, and all that, remember to like, comment, and subscribe.